Whenever I would fly home, there was the city of New York laid out before me. And I thought to myself, this belongs to me. <laughs> In 1977, the city was on the verge of bankruptcy. Businesses were leaving, families were leaving, anybody who could leave would. Good morning, I'm Ed Koch and I'm running for mayor and I need your help, how am I doing? Here was a guy who really represented the rough and tumble of New York, and he was just haunted and damned by one hell of a personality. Shut up, will you, and let me I talk to these people? Up. I knew that of all those who were running, I knew more than they did. There was a sense of momentum building. At the same time, so did the rumors. There were signs in all the trains, vote for Cuomo, not the homo. Why have you never married? Well, I've always thought, wouldn't it be wonderful to be married in Gracie Main Street? You have to get the attention of the public. You gotta get them to follow you. And you can only do that by being bigger than life. He's a national figure. What he says matters on everything. The last time I was in a crowded elevator, I peed on the governor. <laughs> Koch has lived his life in the public. Am I doing all right? Thank you. Hi, everybody. That is his family. I think it's his oxygen. The assumption was that mayors capitulate. Koch said no. And it was a word that most New Yorkers had not heard before. It doesn't move me. It doesn't change me. In his third term, this is where the tide turned on. We're dying. The city is dying. There was no medication whatsoever, which was a total nightmare. His government looked as corrupt as any government ever had. I went into a state of depression. He saw it all slipping away. Well, I think I was a crook. I can't bear that. He created a second life for himself. He's been a political force. He still enjoys the battle. People would say, oh, you must run again. You must run again. And I would say, no. People threw me out. And now the people must be punished. And people love that. <laughs> I still say it occasionally. How am I doing? Thank you. Am I doing all right?